everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you what to do with water beads. Um, some people call these Orbeez. Water beads are if you go over like in a at a craft store, you go over by the floral, the fake floral, floral department, they got these little tiny, tiny little beads that if you add water to them, they grow and they end up growing to something like this. Um, nowadays they call them Orbeez for kids. They're like little like aqua gel beads. Um, and I've had these since I got married. I got married almost five years ago, and I used these gel beads for my wedding. And they're kind of cool, you know, and I can show you guys a picture that looks like this. So that's what I used my water beads for, for my wedding. But you can also use them to water plants. So what you guys would do is just put them in the plants, and then like the water beads would just, you know, would just, uh, keep the plants watery but they do dry out after a while and so we ended up just putting them in this plastic container but I have had them for almost five years don't really know what to do with them trying to get rid of them but then I saw this really cool craft of what to do with them so I put some in a just a plastic bottle and all you guys need is a plastic bottle or beads or water beads you can get them at like Hobby Lobby, Michaels, Joanne Fabrics I think they're like $2.99 for like a packet of them and then you guys just need a balloon and what you're gonna do is just squirt them right into a balloon and you want to come right back up so just squeeze it in there and then I don't know how big I'll get the air out squeeze some more in there let the air out so we'll just have it be about this size let me see if that's about the right size it can go a little bit bigger so let me get some of the air out and one thing is when you get the balloon they want to make a mess so we'll just push the beads down now people say Orbeez, I don't really understand Orbeez, but what you guys kind of want is have it to be a squeeze ball is what we're going to do, and I think this actually might be a good size. Now this is just a regular balloon. What I saw is somebody use like a clear balloon. You can do whatever you want. There's no point of uh, seeing the balloons, but basically all we did is just did a balloon like this, and all you do is just squeeze it. I mean it's a super easy stress ball. I have really have I have a hard time with pain in my hands because me holding my phone, you know, just my right hand is the hand I do a lot of stuff in even though I'm left handed. But this is all we did. That's all we did was just fill the ore beads or water beads into a balloon and you just squish it. I mean it's kinda cool, you know? But I mean it's just a nice stress reliever. Soup, oh, this helps my hands a lot. So yeah, that's just a cute little DIY hand stressor. So if you guys are interested in this, you can either get your own Orbeez or just go to a floral place or a, go by the florist, floral section in like Hobby Lobby Michaels. There's a little package that says water beads. You just add water, you can let them sit overnight and then the beads just grow, grow, grow and they look like this so make sure you guys check that out um, but yeah I mean it was super easy super super easy to make this and you don't even have to use hardly anything I mean you can find a balloon later on you could use this but yes very 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 nice if you guys did like this little or little hand gripper video please give it a thumbs up also don't hit don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more future videos of crafts and stuff. I just want to say thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you guys all later. Bye-bye.